And uh, I think finally, I don't know, I don't think this may be the last one. Let me get your name right. I don't want to mess this one up. Don't mess it up. S Steve Jeltz. Yes. Steve Jeltz. Yes. I, look, I'm going to tell you the honest truth. When you played, I was like a young kid hanging out in the neighborhoods doing my thing. Now you're telling and, my age over there. Uh, <laughs> yeah, you are. <laughs> but... Um, no, Steve um, Jeltz. I, I got. I tell you, I got a tons of baseball cards mm -hmm. from your years. See, I was more of a, a Yankee fan. So, so, but but I was also a Philly fan. But that was more like in the early '80s when Schmidt played with them. Well, he was my third baseman. He was your third baseman. But him and Pete Rose was there. We went to World Series in '83. Uh, my first pitcher I started behind was Lefty. Um, I played before that, um, but, but I then had Gary Maddox had, was on Maddox the team. Was, Maddox was my center fielder. Uh, Matt, um, uh, Matthews was Sarge was in the left, Cisco Escano. So you and must have been a rookie around that yeah, time. Yeah, I was 20. That's years why. Old. See, now I know why. I, 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 listen, those were the years I, uh, like Larry Bo was the short. So I can name the whole team. You know? Bo wasn't there then. Bo was not in 80, it was 83 when I came in. That's what about when Steve I came Carlton? In. Lefty was the first pitcher I started. And I, why I know, because I'm a lefty. No. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, there you go. <laughs> but, uh, yeah. I had Tug McGraw, Jerry Tug Kuzman. Greg Luzinski. Uh, no, Bull was gone was then. Gone. He wasn't. It was, um, let's see. Who else did I name? Uh, man, lots of guys. Uh, Jerry Kuzman was there was then. Was Not Juan Marichal. Uh, no. There was a, I had seven managers. You had a Hispanic outfielder. That was, he was a small guy, real skinny. He was fast, but he was older at the time. I, I'm not going to remember uh, his Cisco name. Cisco Lascano came over from, from uh, Cincinnati with Pete and Joe and Tony Perez. They were all there. So that, those are the guys that were there when I came in. Um, well, tonight, let's talk about real quick about what Billy Staples does here. Best uh, and, and best uh, Scholars Incorporated, bestscholars.org, anybody who wants to look at it. Um, this is your first time? No, no, I've been here for three years. Oh, okay. We missed, see, we, we haven't come for four years. COVID kind of, like, stopped us for the last two. So, so uh, we're back strong. We want to help out more for next year. We want to see we get more stuff donated and uh, bring even some more celebrities if he wants us to ask. But, uh, but what do you think of this whole thing? Well, I mean, this is important. I, I think one, the one little girl came up there, and she said, first things first, and that's God. You put God first, everything else falls in line. And, and with Billy, um, I mean, he's like my brother. Me and Billy connected, and once we connected, that was it. You know, we've been, we've been together uh, since that uh, three years ago, and every time he calls me, needs something. He came up New Year's Eve, spent the New Year's Eve with, with uh, my wife, and him and Janet both came up, and and uh, he, that's when he put, pulled those books out he had over there. We're going to buy, I, if there's I, any left, we're buying some. Yep, I, I was the first one on every one of them books. We started at about, there's about 500 books over there. And we sat there for two and a half hours and did that thing. And I mean, it's just for such a good cause. And that's what it's all about. So what we have is Primal Sports and Primal Sports Charities, what we're starting now. And, it's a, and we're going to be working with Billy, too, on the education program. But it's a multi-sports indoor facility we're working on. That's great. And so that's what's going on with us to, to try and, and keep this thing going. Oh, this yeah. I mean, yeah. Because you saw what happened tonight, and you saw the, the impact they had. Yeah. No, I, 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 got, I, even, I tell you, you even got a nickname tonight, Hope. Yeah. They one, uh, that's that, been his nickname. <laughs> yeah, Hope. That's well, what we're going to make it official tonight. Billy Hope Staples. That's yeah, your new nickname. That's a fact. That's a fact. That's what Billy does. And man, he's the nicest guy you ever want to meet. He'll do anything for you. So, I mean, that's just Billy's. Uh, he, he will go out of his way to do anything he can to give you hope and to help you to help you do it for yourself. I mean, because you have more, you have, you feel a better sense of accomplishment if you're if you do something yourself you don't want something handed to you so he puts you he guides these kids in the right direction and you see what's happening it's it's, it's amazing stuff so we're going to be here next year <clears throat> if you think we had cookies this year for you wait till next year mike's gonna be here my whoopie pies too we'll have <laughs> <laughs> no, we. Well, I, I've had them. They, I know. That, I love will be fine. That, that stuff. That you know what? I, t I told you I wasn't supposed to eat that last night, <laughs> and I did. Cause and it was good. I was going to eat a. I was. It's even my mistake. I was going to eat a piece of it, and I took a bite and ended up eating the whole thing because it was good. So you guys got it going on. Uh, real quick before I let you go, uh, toughest pitcher you ever faced? 
Oh no, you can't tell me that. You can't ask me that one. I had I had the whole Atlanta staff: Smoltz, Glavin, Smiley, Maddox. I had Nolan Ryan. I faced no Roger Clemens, Randy Johnson, uh, Oral Hershiser, Fernando Valenzuela. I feel okay. bad for you, my man. Okay. <laughs> I feel bad. And you still had it above 300 batting average. These guys are killing me here. Yeah, this, yeah, that's a tough time. All right.